Hey YouTube, what is up? How is everybody doing today? I hope your days are going good and your lives are going even better than that. We are going to be jumping into the band known as Oiman. I think that's how you pronounce it, I have no idea. With a song called Nemophila. This was a request by somebody on my YouTube comment section on my my video, which is kind of awesome. Sorry for the no video yesterday. I got distracted by my girlfriend being here and I completely forgot to make a video. For probably quite obvious reasons, but still. Let's just jump into it and see what's going on.
That was very interesting to say the very least. It was not quite in any kind of genre. It's not death metal, it's not symphonic, it's not metalcore. It's not any of the main genres that you would kind of associate this kind of singing style with. It kind of reminded me of an Argent of a Seven Spires, but less symphonicness to it and less uh, diversity or vocal power, or like less vocal power than Argent could do, but it's still a very good song. The technical ability is just out of this world from this band. They play very, very well, and honestly, it's so fun to listen to, just to see them all having a blast and enjoying the set that they're playing, and just seeing the entire song as a whole construct, if you know what I mean. Her vocals are interesting. I think it's just one of those things that grows, and you just need to listen to more of it, and it'll go in here. I think this was a studio session, I believe, so it's kind of probably not the best way for me to get into the band, but it's still a way to get into the band regardless, but I think if I listen to more of their proper record stuff, not just like a live session in terms of like what they're into. And it might help me a little bit more, but as my first initial reaction or impression of this band, they have such talent that they are very, very good at what they do. The singer's voice is her cleans are interesting, but her growls are very, very almost black metal esque in the way that she's got the high pitch um growl mostly. The way that it's mostly like an actual scream rather than a deep growl, which is more like a black metal style, but not really in a black metal style of like instrumental. So it kind of works in like a way, it just sounds different. And that's what a lot of Japanese bands do very, very well. They literally just take things that we know as metal and then merge them and twist them and change them to whatever way they want to go with them. And it just works. Like a lot of these bands are just so good at what they do. It just works together in one cohesive full package. And it just makes shit very, very interesting to listen to. And I do literally just want to hear more of them. I can't really form an opinion based off this because the first thing I've ever, I'm ever hearing, it's a proper like studio session recording so it's not really like a proper mix the master track which is probably what i should be listening to to be perfectly honest with you but thanks for the request whoever I requested it, i can't remember your name for the life of me but thank you for that and i will check out more from this band just to see how i really feel about it and how the music changes from song to song to song to song to see where the growls go to see to see where her cleans go to see how the technical ability of the band rises even more amazing guitar I think amazing drum styles the drummer was amazing just like very very fun and technical and just it added a lot of the fun and the passion into the music which is exactly what you need with this style of music either way i hope you guys enjoyed have a wonderful day evening or night and i will catch you guys in the very next video until then, don't forget to smile, alright? Take it easy.